I got Brussels. I got mushrooms chopped it, chopped up. You feel what I'm saying? The rice of the swing of things. Now, I get perfect rice because it go in this microwave right here. If I got my stuff, I'm ready to go. I gotta rinse my veggies. Got my bristles. And they're going. And you spread them out. And you turn on the eye. Turn on the five. Put it in the middle. Let's see how this go. Oh, did I mention it's a no meat night? Let's go, yeah, let's get this going. I waiting on my Brussels to cook. I hear my children in the back sitting in the book. They sitting there yelling like it ain't looking good. <laughs> Starting to sizzle. So while this is sizzling, well, it's not really, you know, you know, the water is evaporating and things. So once that's over, I get back. Hold on, hold on. We got to add some broccoli to this. We got to add some broccoli and the mushroom. Let me, let me change my words. Can you mix this up? Now we got Brussels and we got broccoli and mushroom, right? Next step, you go add on some oil and some salt. I use, I will, I just bought it, but the pink Himalayan salt and it's great. <laughs> Like big time, like. Grandma, let my mess up. Now I don't want it to be soggy, but I want it to still have a little crunch, but not too much too crunchy. I don't want it to be like, dang, you put a whole tree of broccoli in here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure it's chewable, like this. Let it get like this. Well, some things are soft. Put a little, what is it? What is it? Salt, okay? And I'm gonna put it over here because now I gotta wait on rice. Now we gotta do the egg, especially if I'm gonna do some fried rice. My rice is done. I use some sesame seed oil, it gives it a uh, better flavor. Sesame seed oil is good, it's good. Should I try it? Put all of it in the pan. Well, most of the rice, I need to put all of it. You're gonna put all of that in the pan, most of it. You're gonna keep it moving. Things in there. Put a little soy sauce. My oh, head hurts. Alright, so we're gonna add some soy sauce some more. And some more sesame oil. Because it give it that flavor. It give it that flavor to make it taste like it's from the place. Then you add a little bit, just a little bit for flavoring. That look like little bit, right? One thing wrong with it is that I don't have no egg rolls. Like, yum.